Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks yet again, and today we are continuing on with our steam locomotive. As you guys can see right here, we have a steam locomotive, we have a tender, we have a train carriage. This could actually be used for anything, I suppose, uh, but mostly cargo, I would assume. Uh, if we go backwards, we have our flat gun, if we go backwards from that, we have our artillery gun, and if we go backwards from that, we have our searchlight, uh, which is located on the rear. What we're going to do today is uh, what a bunch of you guys actually wanted to see, which is a troop transport carriage thingamabobby. So that's what we're going to do today. A troop transport carriage. Let's do it. Okie dokie. So I'm not entirely sure what I actually want this to look like in the end, but uh, we're going to try and do something quite cool with it anyway. So let's just get building. In fact, actually, before we do, uh, let's figure out how tall things are before we do it. So... Uh, this guy is this tall, so what we're going to do is grab it from the top all the way to the bottom. In fact, grab it from the bottom first, all the way up to the tippity top. There we go. Go ahead and copy it and make a new one. And there we go. Okay, cool. So if we spawn this in, uh, we actually paste it. There we go. We get rid of this guy. We can build a train carriage out of this. Okie dokie. So, how do we actually want this to work? I have no idea, or literally no idea, so uh, we're going to try and figure it out. We're going to go ahead and whack this on both sides. There we go, that seems to make sense to me. Uh, at the tippity top, we're going to go out sideways with one of these, and we're going to go ahead and whack this in like this as well. And essentially, we're going to go from here up to there, and that's going to be mighty fine. Um, from there, we're going to have to um, make more of them, if that makes sense. So this is going to be extended all the way backwards, and all the way forwards, Hoping that it'll actually look good. Okie dokie, so if we can go ahead and copy this, we can move it forwards, we can also move it backwards, and hopefully that will all actually work out fine. I believe it will, so we're gonna go forwards uh, quite far, there we go, and we're gonna go backwards the same amount. So, if we can, do 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 do, one, okay, two, yes, we're gonna do it until the, um, the center of mass is over the wheel, which is after this one. Bam! There we go. Okay. So now we merge this with this. It's like a big old rainbow. Would you look at that? All right, here we go. Merge all of them together. And then once they're all merged together, um, that is our train carriage. It's going to look strange to begin with, but yeah, this will work. Okie dokie. So now that we got this done then, we need to uh, sort of add windows to it, but we need to figure out what we're going to do with it first. So I would say that seating is kind of important. However, um, it's not really about the seating. It, like, it's, it's just not. It's more about beds. I know that sounds very strange, but it is actually more about the beds uh, so that we can transport as many troops as we can using beds. Yeah, bit weird, I know, uh, but that's kind of that's kind of how it's going to work. Uh, in fact, actually, let's try and raise these up and see if we can fit a seat underneath them. We might be able to, we might not be able to, I don't know. Uh, if we did this, nah, there's no way we can add a seat under there. Um, but what we might be able to do is actually make the floor one of these. Here we go. So if we delete this all the way down to the side, can we actually put one of these in here? Oh, we totally can. So there you go. We would have troops be transported in beds all the way down, and um, that's good. It's better than what I, I would have used, um, which is actually just one of those to fill with troops, which was a thing in World War II, so that could have been it. But no, we're going to go ahead and try and give them something a little bit better. Not much better, though, because it is just going to be a bunch of these over and over and over again, and that's going to be it. So, if we can, we're going to go ahead and grab all of them. Do -do 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 -do. There we go. Go ahead and copy them. We're going to keep moving it backwards and pasting it in, and that'll be it. All right, here we go. There's, uh, there's actually quite a lot of this to do, so we'll do about... In fact, we'll do that many. We'll then go to the other side, and turn it around and do the same, uh, coming backwards. So, turn these around. Paste them in there. There's one. There's two. And there's three. Bam. All right, merge them all together. Let's go. Yes. Yes? Question mark? I think that's all good. Uh, merge these guys with these guys. There we go. Uh, the bottoms need to be merged too. And then all the walls and stuff like that will also be merged. All right, so if I spawn this in, let's go have a little look inside. Yeah, there's just beds. There's just beds and beds and beds. That's fine. Okay, so let's go back to the front and start working on the rest of it. So we're going to go ahead and whack that on there. At the tippity top, we're going to do the same thing uh, with one of these, uh, if possible. There we go. And we're going to go ahead and try and do the rest of it too. So whack this. Oh, I don't know if that's right. That's not quite right. I feel like at this end, we're going to bring this out another like four. One, two, three, four. 
We're going to bring this out another four as well. One, two, three, four. We're going to bring these guys this way as well. And we're going to build the entire thing in like this. Uh, delete this guy. Yes. Put one of these pieces in here like so. Good. We can then fit a ladder. And then this guy could go here like this. Bam. And that'll be fine. Ladder. Let's do it. So attach this directly onto there. We might lower it down by one to add another ladder. And that would be great. So do this and this. Delete this guy. Add some pipes so that it looks like it's actually connected. And there we go. Okay. That's that's fine. That is mighty fine. All right. Do all of this. Um, and then we're going to have to come up with an actual, like, I don't know, front end. I don't know what it should look like, though. <laughs> I actually really don't know. I feel like we're going to go ahead and have an overhang. So we're going to do one of these. Uh, we're going to do this also, just like so. And we're going to do this across the top. Hang on, did I accidentally just put some stuff in there? I didn't. All right, do that across the top. There we go. And I don't know. I think that's probably fine. There we go. Do it like, uh, nah, I don't know. Yeah, leave it like that. Leave it just like that. Okay, so uh, we'd fill in this bit. It doesn't want to be a part of it, so that's good. There we go. Uh, we're going to fill in this little bit right here as well. We're going to fill this in a little bit more. And essentially, we just need to jut this out, whack a door on it, and that'll be fine. Okay, so we're going to use these doors. I know it's not quite right, but that's okay. Delete all of this on this side. Whack that directly in there. Go ahead and do this from here all the way up the side. And there we go. Yeah, it's a little bit strange. Actually, it needs to come out one. Uh, and that'll make it look, hopefully, hopefully a tiny bit better. So cut this. Move it forwards one. Paste it there. Delete this guy. There we go. We're then going to go ahead and do this. Mm -hmm. There we go. Uh, and we're going to go up a little bit more, just like this. And fill it in. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Merge these guys together, and that will be fine. That will be A-OK. -okay. Actually, delete these guys. Smash this bit into there like this. And we're going to have to actually do this. It's a little bit annoying, but it'll look better in the end, maybe. So do that. There we go. And yeah, I'm OK with that. OK, so currently, that is what it looks like. Um, OK, we're going to add windows to this because we can, and uh, I think that'll be all right. Okay, so uh, in order to actually line these up then, let's go ahead and add some windows in in random places. In fact, actually, we'll just line it up on the outside, try and make it look good that way, and then we'll do it the other way afterwards. So delete these. Uh, up four across three. There we go. Yeah, this will be fine. Delete all of these guys. We're going to have a door in there, which is just one of these. Delete this as well. Uh, all the way up. So that we can add a door. Yes. Okay, we want to do this on both sides though, so... Undo all of that, delete it all, whack it back in so that it fits, and that'll be okay. Bosh. There we go. Okay, so, um, now that we've done that, we're going to have to do it all the way along, and that'll be okay. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. So, my main problem with this is I didn't really want to do this. I wasn't going to do this. Um, but I guess we'll see how it looks in the end. Okay, so, um, I suppose it would actually look better if it wasn't all in this color? Uh, it's all a bit, I don't know, a bit too dark for me right now. We're gonna go ahead and do that right there. We're gonna go to the other side and do the same thing later. Um, but yeah, we needed it in a different color. And we have now got it in a different color. Um, wooden? I guess wooden sides do make some sort of sense on this. Yeah, all the way down the edges. I think that's fine. Okay, then we'll obviously put in... Other stuff. So we need windows. Let's go ahead and grab some of those. Uh, we're going to go with three by threes. Make them black. Put them there. And we're going to go with like an angled one. Uh, for the rest of it. So wherever I can put this, that would be great. So maybe like this. Yeah, okay. So these are going to be our little train windows. Uh, and they're going to go all the way along. And that's going to be okay. So copy this. Leave it about four. Paste it again. Leave it about four. Paste it again. There we go. Do the same from the other end and we'll be good. So, oh, actually, I don't know. Ah, we don't need to do that, actually. Leave it four. There we go. And then paste it. And then what we'll do is we'll actually press U. Take it to the other side and do the same thing. Paste it. There we go. Four. Paste. Yep. Four again. Paste it. And four again. There we go. Paste it. So we'll merge all of these in. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. There we go. Uh, and then what we'll do is we'll actually copy this end onto that end, and that'll be fine, I think. I'm, I'm almost sure that'll be okay. Cool. 
Okay, so what I'm going to do next is uh, maybe a little bit strange, but we're going to essentially go from here all the way to the other end, just like so. There we go. And we're going to do this guy right on there, just like so. Okay, that's fine. We then need to put a thingy-mabobby in there. A, um... What's the word? What would the word be? Um... A bogey. We need to put a bogey in there so that it actually goes on the tracks properly. Okie dokie. Right, pivot. Uh, pivot is what we need. Yes. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and get one of these guys, smash it into there just like so, and our bogey uh, will be there. So if we go to wheels... Uh, wheels, yep, good. We can actually grab a train assembly. And we could actually just have one of those directly on there. The problem is these ladders get in the way, um, and that's not really very good. <laughs> that's not really that good. Um... I mean, the other way of doing this would actually be to move this further backwards uh, by about four or something. So let's grab this, delete that. Um, actually, undo, 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 undo. There we go. We're going to go to this guy, then get ourselves a pivot, and then whack it in, and hopefully that'll be good. Pivot. Yes, one of these guys is fine. Uh, 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 uh. Grab this, whack it on there, just like so, and I think that'll be okay. Spawn it in, yeah. Yeah, that's okay. Okie dokie. So, the next thing that we'd want to do then is uh, design something around the outside to give it a little bit more strength. Uh, in order to do that, we're just going to go ahead and grab these guys. We're going to go from the bogey uh, downwards about two... Uh, two might be too many. Actually, just one. There we go. And we're going to send this backwards as well. Again, because we can. So, there you go. Alright, that's fine. So, let's go ahead and grab the entire front end. Do 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 um, all the way to the top, all the way to the bottom, including the wheels, there we go. All the way on the side, bring it all the way down the side. Actually, grab these as well, and also these. Uh, and essentially, we're going to grab it from... I don't know where the middle is. <laughs> I don't actually know where the middle is, but around here, I think. In fact, if we do this, and we copy that, we then... Oh yeah, that's nowhere near the middle, is it? So if I turn this around, I bring it to this end. I mean, that fits, but it's not quite right. Um, doo -doo -doo. So the end of the beds. Where's the end of the beds? A one, two, three, four. Okay, four. So we have to go uh, one, two, three, four. There, paste. Okay, so this is right, I think. So if we spawn this in, what does it look like? doesn't look too bad. Uh, that door looks awful. Um, and that door looks awful over there. But, in the grand scheme of things, the rest of it actually looks okay. Okay, so, what is the next thing that we actually want to do with it? Well, uh, the idea is we actually use the same one of these on every single one of them. Uh, so that we know that it all joins together properly. So, let's grab all of these guys. There we go. Go ahead and copy them. Uh, load up our war train thingamabobby, wherever it is. This guy. And make sure that we attach it on in the right place, just like, in fact, just like this. There we go. Uh, merge that with that. There we go. Awesome. Turn this around. Take it to the other end. Do the same thing. And that'll be it. Bam. Okay, merge that with that. Merge this with this. There we go. And we should be able to actually um, attach this to our train cars, which is exactly what we wanted. Um, the other thing that I want to do, actually, is grab one of these. Yes. Go ahead and put that there, just like this, and we'll leave it. And that is it. Uh, so we'll just attach these guys to here like this. Get ourselves a railing, or whatever it is called. Segment end, yep, yeah, there we go. Smack that directly into there. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. Just like that. Just like that, there we go. And now we can walk from carriage to carriage. That's it. Okay, so I was just experimenting like a tiny bit with what this looks like. What if we actually left this open? I know it's a little bit strange to do, to leave it open, but what if we do? Um, so that like, everybody could get in and out of the carriage really quickly. I think that makes some sort of sense, maybe. It also actually looks better than having a door, I think. Uh, it looks a bit strange. I could put like a, a, a blah, 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 like a modular door in, or whatever it's called. Um, but I'm not sure I want to. I don't know how I feel about it. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do this. We're gonna delete these guys. We're gonna paint this across the top like this. Paint these guys. Do that all the way down. Um, and that's fine. We'll leave it like that for now. It is a little bit odd though. 
Okay, next thing, door. Do -do 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 door. Yes, we're gonna grab a door frame. We're gonna delete all of this across the top end. Bam. We're then gonna put the door frame all the way across the top end, and hopefully that looks okay. I think it'll actually make it look better. Yes, it definitely does. That actually looks awesome. Um, and yeah, I'm happy with that. Okay, so what else would you actually need in this situation uh, if you were to board this train? I guess you would actually want maybe some sort of seating area if we wanted to carry more people. So let's go ahead and add some seats inside of here. Um, we'll actually just go ahead and whack them on the sides just like this and add some seats across there like, like that. There we go. There's one, two, uh, three, four, five, six. There we go. We'll go ahead and attach that guy in the middle, and I think that's fine. Um, really, we might be able to add more seats. If we go to the center of this, and we do something like that, I guess, we can actually just add some more seats down the middle. So there's one, two. Um, we'll do it the other way on the other side. There we go, three and four, and we'll do that right there. We'll actually attach this to the ceiling too, just because we can. But there we go, we've actually added more seating. Actually, delete these, whack that in. Delete those, whack this in, and we should be able to get away with this. One, two, three, four. There we go. I'm happy! Nice! Spawn it in, let's have a little walk through, and see what it looks like. Climb on in. Yeah, we get our little seating, and our beds. Sure. Okay, it's very dark in there. Uh, it's, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's extremely dark in here. So, we're gonna go ahead and paint the beds like this. Um, da 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 we're going to do all of the same things on all of these, all the way down, and we can change the other things afterwards if we need to. Um, not that we definitely do, but yeah. So I'm going to paint all the beds, try and make them look nicer, and we'll go with that. Okie dokie, I'm going to show you guys what it's like on the inside now. So if we run this way, we can climb up inside. It is brown on the walls, brown on the roof. If we go this way, we've got all of these guys. Uh, the beds are painted like this, that pillow needs painting, but that is it. Oh, and, the, and that one. Um, but yeah, pillows are white, covers are brown, sheets are, um, grey. So there you go. Anyway, let's go ahead and add some more to it. So, we're gonna go ahead and paint those guys first. It's kind of, kind of important. Not really, though. Uh, there we go. And what we'll do is we'll add a fire extinguisher in here. Just in case you need one. You probably never will, but there you go. Fire extinguisher is gonna go inside of here, just like this. And we'll add first aid kits as well. Because we can. Do, 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 do. One. I know it's like not really a thing, but there you go. That's fine. Okay, go to the other side, do the same thing. One, two. One, two. There we go. Awesome. Fire extinguisher. Let's do it. There we go. And I'm happy with this. I am happy with this. Bam. Whack that there. Whack this here. Save it as the carriage. Nice. Um, so, lastly. Uh, we need some lights. So let's grab some lights. Here we go. These guys will slot them into the roof in certain places and that'll be it. We'll be good to go. So actually, we'll add two in the center. They're going to go like this on the sides. So we'll add those like that. That's fine. We'll go to the front. We'll do the same thing centrally above the door like this. And on the other end, we're going to do the exact same thing because we should. There we go. Okay. I then think we should actually attach them to the ceiling like so. Because I think it looks sort of correct in that sense. So we're going to do that as well. Here we go. And we're going to go to the other end, do the same thing. And that'll be fine too. There we go. Okay, nice. I'm happy with that. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. I've added the buttons in for the lights. They should work, which is good. Uh, we're going to go ahead and make the lights actually quite dark. We're going to make them brown. Uh, and hopefully, once we've done that, um, it will actually kind of be dull in here. Because that's sort of what I want uh, from this so hopefully it is actually very dull in here, but there you go So let's go ahead and save it once more. There we go and spawn it in. Let's see what it looks like There she is doesn't look too bad. I added these guys as well as little supports for the beds I added them here as well and on the other end as well, obviously um, So if we turn the lights on This is what they look like if we change it to nighttime uh, And we push it outside. I'll show you guys what it looks like outside Okay, so here it is. Uh, it is quite dull in here, which it's supposed to be, and um, I actually think it's kind of reminiscent of what it should look like, so I'm actually really happy with this. Um, and we will be saving it as it is. This is without, that is with. Yeah, nice.
Okay, so what is this thing missing? Well, it is missing a logo. I feel like we should add a logo to this. And also, uh, I feel like we should add some other bits of brown, like different colored browns. So we're actually gonna go ahead and add this across the bottom. There we go, all the way. And we're gonna add it across the top too. There we go, just to give it a little bit of extra detail. And uh, we're also gonna add it here and here on every single one of these. That's quite a lot, but um, let's see what it looks like. It might look good, it might look bad, I don't know. Also, I am only doing this on one side by accident, but we'll go ahead and put it on the other side later on. Let's put it in, let's see what it looks like. Yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe, I don't know. Maybe we don't need the line at the top. So we'll get rid of it. Mm -hmm. There we go. Yeah, we'll just have these lines go up there from the bottom. Uh, and that'll be great. That will be great. All right, get rid of all of these all the way along. And that's it. All right, spawn it in. Let's see what that looks like. Yeah, a little bit better, I think. Okay, so unfortunately for me, uh, these guys, uh, the logos, are actually three wide. Or they're actually just an odd number wide. Um, and that's really, really frustrating. But uh, we will put them in like this. Uh, we'll do the same on the other end, and that'll be fine. Okay, there we go. We're gonna leave it like this. We're, we're gonna leave it like this for right now. So, let's go ahead and save this real quickly. Bam, there we go. Let's get it on the back of the train. And, uh, actually, the roof maybe shouldn't be white. Just because it's a war train, we don't really want to be, uh, like, showing ourselves up like that. So, let's go with, like, a darker gray. Maybe even just a fully gray roof. Yeah, we'll do it. We'll do a fully gray roof for now. Save it. Yep, there we go. And that'll be fine. So, we're gonna add it to the back of this. Maybe even in the middle. I don't know. At the front. We'll do it at the front. Uh, and we'll see what that looks like. Okay, so there it is. Uh, attached to everything, I do believe. Everything is all attached, yes. Uh, and I don't think it actually looks too out of place uh, in the middle of that. Um, to be totally honest with you guys. So, let's get the train moving again. See what it looks like when it's moving. Uh, and we'll go from there. Jump in. Yeah. Nice. Okay, let's go backwards and have a quick little look at this. So you get inside, it might be the only one with actual proper lights. I actually know the locomotive has it. Um, but yeah, you can walk through, lights are on, pretty nice. Walk out the side, that's fine. Okay, we don't want them too comfortable, um, but we don't want them really, really uncomfortable. Like standing up in one of these all day. So there you go, cool. Okay, so this is what it looks like when it's moving. Let's go ahead and sit in this seat and uh, have a little look with this, shall we? Yes. So the train is moving along, that is what it looks like. There's our troop carriage. I might put some doors in there. I feel like we need some because uh, it being wide open is a little bit strange. Uh, the only other thing that I can think of doing actually is move the beds in one. We can have a wall and then the door can go on the inside. And then that might actually work out quite nicely. Maybe. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I think we've done a pretty good job so far. We've got obviously got our uh, locomotive itself. We got the tender. We now got the uh, the passenger thing, our troop transport. We also have this, the cargo one. The flak, the artillery, and also the spotlight. There is some more to come as well, because a few of you guys have said flatbeds for tanks and stuff. Uh, we might do something like that in the future. I'm not sure. But anyway, for right now, thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you next time. Goodbye.